Hello and welcome to the Intel Innovation Summit. My name is Taylor Newell from Oracle Cloud Infrastructure. I'm the Senior Director of our Global High Performance Computing Program. So glad that you were able to make it and I'm excited to share with you Oracle Cloud's story with Intel. Oracle Cloud has been around now for about five years and we've continued Oracle's long-standing tradition of looking for the best performing hardware to sit underneath of our software, whether it's uh, relational databases or, uh, or applications, we've always looked for the best performing hardware uh, to, run, to sit underneath of our software. When Oracle Cloud Infrastructure began about five years ago, we continued with that strategy. And in fact, we found that that played very well into the high performance computing workloads. My entire career, I've been running simulations on top of HPC clusters. I was very excited to be able to build out those same clusters in a cloud environment. And the approach that Oracle Cloud has taken is to run bare metal servers in a public cloud environment. So our customers are able to go out to a, uh, a web interface if they want, click a button, and a few seconds later, have a high performance computing cluster up and running. It has absolutely revolutionized the way that our customers are running HPC workloads. And I'm excited to tell you a little more about it. First of all, our customers run globally. We have the largest cloud footprint uh, of any of the public cloud providers and the largest HPC footprint of those cloud providers as well. We have over 17 regions that have HPC or GPU hardware in those regions. In North America, South America, Asia, Europe, um, even Australia. And, and we have more exciting uh, data center deployments to announce moving forward. We have high performance computing all over the world. Wherever our HPC customers are, they're going to have access at a very low latency, a TCP latency uh, to, those, to those data centers, to those HPC data centers. Of course, once they're inside the data centers, our ultra low latency cluster networking uh, allows the HPC workloads to run at scale. And we'll talk some more about that uh, in, a few, uh, in a few moments. HPC on Oracle Cloud Infrastructure has been designed different than any other public cloud. As I mentioned, we have standardized on bare metal across the board. When customers create HPC clusters, there is no virtualization layer. Our customers have the option to deploy these machines with no Oracle control plane or software on these machines at all. It allows customers to achieve the um, the latencies that they need to achieve. They're, we can provide with cluster networking, our RDMA technology that sits on top of Rocky V2, uh, our customers can achieve less than 1.5 microsecond latency. When you combine that with all of the other cloud advantages uh, or Oracle cloud advantages of extremely low cost, flexibility, the ability to stand up multi-thousand core clusters and tear them down uh, very quickly. And then of course that bare metal performance. With all of those things combined, we have enterprise customers that are able to run production grade HPC workloads on top of Oracle Cloud Infrastructure. They're able to do that less expensive than their on-premises HPC clusters. Now when we talk about our relationship with Intel, it has been Fantastic. Every generation, Intel provides better and better performing hardware. And that's what our customers demand. In fact, I, we put together this uh, a real quick slide showing our, um, our Skylake uh, generation HPC hardware compared with our Ice Lake generation HPC hardware. Um, so number one, you'll see that we have 100% scalability across this entire cluster. So from uh, from 72 cores all the way up to 576 cores, we have linear scalability. But even more impressive than that scalability is the performance increase between these two generations. So we're showing ANSYS Fluent, uh, the, the ANSYS Fluent rating for the 140 million cell benchmark model. 
Now the ANSYS Fluent Rating is the number of simulations that you can run in a 24-hour period. And you'll see that with the optimized 3.36, which is Oracle Cloud's Ice Lake offering, we were able to increase the number of simulations that our customers could run by almost 20%. And what's more exciting is these two generations of processors are the exact same price. Uh, that allows our customers to get even better price performance for their HPC workloads. And we've been running on Intel for a long time. In fact, there's a, a generation that we're not showing on here uh, that we started off with, with Intel. The Intel Skylake offering was extremely powerful for us. Uh, it's what allowed Oracle Cloud to establish our high performance computing footprint and show to our customers the type of performance that they could see in the cloud, which was higher, faster, uh, with lower latency than our customers had ever seen in the cloud before. Now, as I showed with the latest generation Intel chip offering, uh, we expand on that almost 20% in, in many workloads. And then I want to highlight this, uh, this column in the middle. Our customers have the ability to select any number of cores with any amount of memory. There is no t-shirt sizing uh, with our optimized flex offering. If you want five cores with 300 gigs of memory, you have the ability to select that option. So any number of cores, any amount of memory, it, it really is a, a game changer for the cloud. Our customers are taking advantage of the performance and the flexibility, and of course, the low cost. Uh, one of these premier customers is Nissan. Uh, Nissan, of course, is using Oracle Cloud infrastructure to run HPC workloads, computational fluid dynamics, crash analysis. This allows them to get to market quicker with their products. It also allows them to increase the ROI on their HPC applications. As we showed earlier with, uh, with that ANSYS benchmark, our customers, Nissan, can run more simulations in the same amount of time. So that allows them to make their cars safer, to make the cars more aerodynamic. And it's not just manufacturing customers. Of course, we've all been impacted by COVID. Since the start of the pandemic, our not only our customers, but we also opened our HPC platform up to the world uh, to begin doing genomic simulation, to begin protein folding on top of Oracle Cloud HPC. And they were able to do it faster. They were able to do it more efficiently uh, to get the results back uh, quicker, to include their simulations as part of their, the overall research process. The results of this have been extremely exciting and it's been very neat to see um, all of the different ways that our customers have utilized Oracle Cloud's HPC combined with Intel processors uh, to attack different parts of this problem. I'd like to thank you very much for joining me today as I've gotten to share a little bit about what we're doing uh, with Oracle Pu Oracle's public cloud uh, and high performance computing. Intel sits at the core of our HPC offering. Go ahead, click, uh, click on a few other things inside of the portal. Uh, if you have some questions, we would love for you to come visit our website as well at oracle.com slash cloud slash HPC. Thank you for your time.